is for psychicfuture.com and this is your horoscope from the 12th to the 18th of November. So as you can see I am down by the river Ganges in Rishikesh, India. So this is basically the holy river for India and it fits in really nicely with what's going on in the planets right now because this week not only have we got Venus going direct so no more Venus retrograde but we've also got Mars moving into Pisces. So Venus going direct first of all, this is going to be the culmination of all of the lessons that we've just had recently. So all of the things that we've learned about ourselves, the way that we relate to other people, this is all going to start to flow a little bit better now and we're going to have a few less, less, a few less lessons to learn because it's going to be like all of a sudden we kind of realise some things. So we realise the way that we relate to other people, we realise how much independence we need from other people. We're going to realise, you know, what things we need to do to make our experience of the world a little bit easier. And as Venus moves direct, then we'll start to feel a little bit easier in some of our relationships and less like this kind of struggle that we've been having over the last few weeks. So then Mars into Pisces. This is going to be, uh, for you in particular Aries, quite a strong movement because you're ruled by Mars. So it might be that all of a sudden your motivations kind of feel a little bit more creative, you want to get a little bit deeper into things, perhaps you want to connect with other people, you want to help other people a little bit more and do some kind of service for the world. And you can do that in little ways, it doesn't have to be, you know, go off and start a charity or something. You can do it by just, you know, being kind to people, smiling at people, perhaps doing a little bit of art in your spare time, just something that's creative or something that's empathetic that will help you to channel this kind of quite strong energy into something Pisces. And again, we've got this water theme here, so this is, this is a very strong, uh, movement from the planets right now that it will it'll pay to actually try and channel it into something because otherwise it might feel a little bit confusing or like um, you don't really know what to put that energy into so if you can try and do one of those two things something creative or something empathetic then that will really help to yeah channel that energy into something so have a fabulous week guys and I hope to see you next time much love